I'm your number one fan. And don't even think about anybody coming for you. Not the doctors, not your agent, not your family. Because I never called them. Nobody knows you're here. Paul is a famous writer that sold over one million copies of his book series. He was headed to his known place, his cabin to finish the second half of the series when his car crashed, and a crazed fan found him and brought him back to her house. Can't you see it's what God wants? If you're so brilliant, I would think you'd certainly be able to see that. We're put on this earth to help people, Paul. Mr. Sheldon? sure they could go on working, but they also had to make sure they could never run away. This is what they call the hobbling punishment, which is in the form of blows to the ankle, is suggested by damage to the lateral and medial areas of the calcaneus. Torture in the form of blows to the bottoms of feet is evidenced by damage to the plantar surfaces of various other foot bones. Trust me. God's sake. It's for the best. Hey, please. You see, I've known for some time why I was chosen to save you. You and I were meant to be together forever. Now our time in this world must end. At this point, Paul realizes that he is not leaving that house. The only way he is leaving is if she takes his life. Does she finally marry Ian? Or will it be Winthorne? It's all right here. Paul is desperate to find a way to get out, and one of the ways to defend yourself against a kidnapper is to distract them and find a weapon to use against them. Paul, you can't! 